Hello everyone, my name is Neil and today we'll be uninstalling Note Red and then reinstalling Note Red. Now this will help get rid of some bugs. Now the first step that we want to do is open up a terminal and see if we have something to update. It's very important. So we do sudo apt and then we do update. And this will find any files in the system, any programs that need some updates, and then it's gonna bring all those files. It says that four packages can be upgraded. Um, after that, you do sudo at upgrade, and what this does, it pulls everything that needs to be updated and tells you if you want to update. In this case, although some stuff are upgradable, they're not really upgradable, um, so we don't have to worry about that. Now to test, I'm going to close this terminal, everything's up to date, and we're going to test Node Red. We want to make sure Node Red is active on this computer. So if I type Node Red, server should be able to start, and it does, it started. Um, if I go to the, my local Node Red server, uh, it should be able to come up. And we have here not red. Uh, it's the first installation, so it's, it's bringing everything the first time. I got one flow. Um, that's it. There's nothing. It's clean. So we can close that out. <coughs> now we can close this out. So we're gonna start uninstalling Note Red. How we, how do we do this? The first thing we want to do is make sure that Note Red is not running. So we can do that by typing Note red stop and node red is no longer running my computer after that we want to do our first command which is the following command sudo npm minus g remove node red notice that there is space here there's space here there's space here and here but not here so once you do this, the computer will start removing everything needed to actually run Node Red. It may take a while, it might not take a while, depending on how much stuff you have in Node Red. Once that is done, you can do the same and just type admin by it. Yeah, that was fast. And then after that, we want to remove the Node Red files that we have in our system. So we can do rm which is the remove command minus r and then we want to delete everything that's not red in the computer the first time nothing shows because it it found the file and it deleted it if you run it again it's going to say that we don't have that file in the system so I'm gonna close this out open a new terminal I'm going to attempt to run uh, run not red and it says no red cannot be found this time so right now no red is no longer in my computer in the description below we'll have a script that will install no red again um, it looks something like this this will take care of uninstalling anything that you have of no red like files that might be lingering around and then it'll delete them it'll delete all the versions of node.js and all this stuff and then it'll pull everything back up and reinstall it's going to ask you if you want to install say yes it's going to give you a warning about make sure your sd card is backed up if you have problems my corrupt system if this happens then we just need to re-image the raspberry pi itself um, so we click yes and then it's going to ask you if you want to install Raspberry Pi specific nodes. We are using a Raspberry Pi, so we want that. So we hit yes. And it's going to start doing everything. I'm going to pause the video here and wait for it to install. And okay, we are back. So everything finished installing. Um, we can prove this uh, by going back to the terminal and typing not red and the server is back up now